Hey Game Hawks, I'm gonna take you on a tour to third Montana 3781 RL Rear Living Four Season Camper. Here we go. I'm Missy. I'm Mike. And we're, we're the, the Camper Hawks. All right, Camper Hawks, I'm going to talk close to the microphone because we are by the roadway, but it, I, I caught this, this camper caught my eye for the interior brightness of it. I wanted to point it out to you to show you what it's like. This is the Montana made by Keystone. This is a 2021. Start you off with the front with the uh, road armor, your fifth wheel hitch, trail ale fifth wheel hitch. Here's your storage compartment right up front with your hydraulic system and your battery box area. big massive storage now this is kind of disappointing so so far i only see one 20 pound propane tank that's 20 pound not 30. big big pastor stores look how look how big this pastor storage is big pastor storage you got aluminum frame you got a light up top. It is heated under here with a duct system. There's your inverter right there. Right here is your out outdoor entertainment center, where you hook your TV up to, and you got a uh, you got a vacuum system for your interior. It's where you change your bag. Outdoor outlet. There's your bedroom bed slide. Two awnings, one there, and one on the extra slide itself, which is a bonus. I love those when they put them on the slides. Extend your camping area. Twin axle unit. Self-leveling, I'll take you on inside. Bright colors in here, this is called the Modern Maple Edition. The Montana Modern Maple Edition. Suburban range, oven, three burner top, high point microwave, got your wine cabinet up here. Plenty of uh, island. There's your pull out trash can, that's a plus. You got two pull out trash cans, look at that. Storage under there, there's your sink covers, go on top here. Nice looking unit, get blackout shades. There we go. Mercier window right here. This will come in and out. Yes, it will. Look at that. You got a love seat and a couch. There's your TV. You got storage center or entertainment center over top of it. Nope, that is just storage. Here is your entertainment center. Yep, you got your Jensen speaker system and surround sound type speakers. Vents in the floor. Nice little finish up front here. That is glass. Coming around here, you have a washer dryer storage area and or closet. Plenty of storage here. There's your fuse panel. There's your uh, inverter switch right there. Max air fan and all your switches for your slides and pumps and accessories. Storage up top here, storage up top here. Got Samsung residential fridge. Bottom freezer with a nice tray. Nice little countertop, that is. And here's a pop-up charging port. Looking nice. Plenty of storage, plenty of kitchen cabinetry. Let's take a walk up here. There's your central vac right there. This is your dust pan for the central vac. Flip that up and sweep right into it. Lighting system right here for the night light. Big window here in the hallway. Here's your bath. Hollow core doors. 
Nice big walk-in shower with a with a step. You got storage over here. Looking good, looking good. There's a toe kick or kick for your door so you don't mash it up, bend it up, tear it up. Skylight, plenty of room in this closet. Dual sinks. GFI there. His and her cabinet three. And a max and fair in here, which is nice. Going into the bedroom. It's getting a little dark. Let's see, we'll pull some shades up. This is a king bed. We got a window over the bed top. We got lights up top over the bed. This is your slide control for the extra slide of the bed. And you got your own separate uh, AC thermostat in here, floor registers. There's a power outlet there, power outlet there beside the bed with USB ports. Storage under the bed. There you go. And there's your chairs, spare chairs for the dinette. Again, that dinette extends out. You can add more chairs to it. They have a whisper quiet AC system. I see. There's your uh, cabinetry for the uh, bat or for the bedroom. You got outlet there and outlet there. That's nice. Plenty of storage space here. These are not dovetailed, they are stapled. That makes a difference to you. Cabinet or the um, closet is pretty darn big. Plenty of stuff to hang. But they have also a cabinet in here. Well, there's your clothes hamper. There you go, that's nice. There's a clothes hamper right there. There's an outlet there also. So plenty of cabinetry in your bedroom for storage shoe bins and so forth so that's nice puck lighting in the ceiling it's got a little Wi-Fi thing going on here coming back down the hallway looking out into the unit this is all real wood up here nice looking unit give you an overview of it All right, let's go take a look outside. This thing is rated with the saline tires, G-rated tires, six-year warranty on the tires. It's got a road armor suspension. It does have a towing hitch, two-inch hitch, up to 3,000 pounds on the back of it. There's your central vac, day-night roller shades. So, pretty good-looking unit. Check outside. Again, on your campsite, you have two big windows. You have an awning over top of the, or mounted to the slide, so it does not occupy half your slide with an awning. That's good. You got a rear ladder, LED lights in the back. There's your connection for your power. It is uh, Furion camera equipped, ready to roll. Just plug in your Furion camera. Looks like a 12 gallon water heater. Here's your water work station. Your low point drains right there and your battery disconnect. Big time storage in this unit. Let's see. There's your other 20 pound propane tank. So you get two 20 pound propane tanks. This thing weighs in at 13.3, maximum weight 16.6. So it weighs in at 13.3, maximum weight 16.6. And here's your level up leveling system, one touch leveling system. Very nice. Pretty good looking colors. Again, this is the Keystone Montana unit 3781 RL. 3781RL. Alright, thanks for watching. Please click below, subscribe to the channel, give us a big thumbs up. And this one is on display in Camper World in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. See you in the next video.